Okay, some of the things we're actually going to be going over in class tonight um, is how we're going to be weaving the hands into our grappling and we want to keep everything in close and tight. So when it comes through, a lot of times we'll actually come through and we'll grapple the elbow, but I want to focus on the cup of the hand here. So as it comes through, I'm going to weave and come up. Now as I do this, I, I showed earlier how we can come up to here with a grab and catch on the top of long seven and actually get the person to go. This time I'm actually going to use my forearms to grapple his here. So as he comes again, here as I weave across to here as I lock, notice how it comes through similar to the lower X block or the Juju Uke. Here as I come through, I can actually drop him with that as well. So again, one time here coming up, keeping the hands tight. As I do this, I'm grappling and I maneuver just enough to get him to move. A couple different ways that we play with this. I can weave my hands around. Now I can actually catch upcoming opposite directions here. So I can come back and weave here, weave around, catch in the arm. From here, here's my augmented technique. Actually catch him with that direction there. So as you come through again to here, I can catch it up, weave it around to here, feed to here. I can also grab with the hand. If I use them, use my forearm to go up towards the elbow to get him to lock down this direction. So as we come through, some things you can play with here, feed, feed, rolling the hands up here. So now it's a different one. So he comes up, touch this direction. I'm going to come around. As I do this, I'm going to make sure that his palm, instead of it facing me, I can catch him this direction or if I come through, I'm going to sweep up the arm, getting the hand almost like he's holding a tray. As I do this, I'm going to cut at a 45, and it drops him in where I could take him out from here. So there's a couple of different things you can play with going through. Uh, try it in your school. Let me know what you think.